Now, the site of the 1 October shooting will always be hallowed ground. Soon, some of that land will be turned into a memorial to those lost and a tribute to survivors. However, the valley's first place to come together and mourn will always remain. Good Day Las Vegas anchor John Langler revisits the organic creation of the downtown healing garden. It's just an idea I had the morning after the mass shooting. Landscape architect Jay Plegencool was trying to start his Monday, the Monday after. I, mean, I was having coffee at a little cafe where we always started our Monday morning. The waitress was so distraught. She told me this horrific story about her daughter calling her. She was crying. She said, Mom, they're shooting at me. They're shooting at me. I just realized that this changed everything. And I also started to think about all these people that needed to come together someplace. And by chance, I happened to have the city attorney's number. So I called him to ask if there was a place that we could set up a, a memorial, create a garden. They said, would this piece of property work? And I said, sure. And the next question, what are you going to do with it? I went to a coffee shop and started doodling on a napkin, um, different ideas. You know, we just sort of started pulling things out and it, it just flowed. Luckily, you know, the, the city bought into the idea and people came together. From a coffee shop napkin to shovels in the ground, the healing garden took shape. How did the healing garden help you? It's a long story. <laughs> um, I, I live a totally different life uh, post October 1st than I did before. I really don't have anything to do with the garden anymore, but um, it does make me happy that people still use it and they come together. Now, far from downtown, a new memorial is planned at the site of the 1 October massacre. I think it's a great thing. And with the memorial, it's a chance to really learn about who these people were and really make us think. But the healing garden will always hold a special place in Plague and Cool's heart. The tragedy changed the city. The garden changed his life. But this special spot will remain. Well, in a way, it's it's our community backyard collectively. And, and I think that's awesome. John Langler, 8 News Now.